Welcome back everybody to some more Medieval Engineers. So today we are doing some workshop items again. I want to showcase what good people can build in this game because I could never even fathom of building this. You can see we have some sort of pulley line up here to a castle up there. And uh, yeah, we I thought I would check out some of the most popular ones on the workshop right now. Uh, some will be castles, some will be uh, weapons, and uh, yeah, we'll just have some fun. Now I do want to announce that I have a giveaway for this game. Thanks to you guys for all your support. I'm going to be giving away one copy of this game. I will put a link to the giveaway in the description below. Just put your email in there and... I guess I'll say five days from when this video goes up, I will announce the win winner on my Twitter as well as personally email whoever won, and uh, yeah, they get a copy of this game, so if you like what you see, go ahead and uh, join that if you want. So I gotta figure out how the hell I can even get on, I guess you don't even get on this thing, you just kinda, well, you obviously you get on it, I just, it's, it's kinda stuck a little too high, alright, let's cheat a bit here. Eh, eh. Let me in. Let me in. Okay. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. We'll just, you know what? You know what? Let's just do that. Let's just... No, that's not... <laughs> okay. Obviously, I need to use the pulley, but uh, I don't even know if I'm supposed to be in this. I, I don't know what's going on. Okay, guys. For the sake of realism, let's just pretend we're in a cart going up this. This this wonderful invisible carts. Like, we, we are on next-gen technology right now going up this uh this rail into, of course... This castle, that's a brilliant idea for a castle. Have one railway up to it, but then again, if they break that railway, you're kind of stuck in your castle, uh, and you might just starve. But yeah, this is the most popular download right now, and for good reason. This is a badass castle. There is a lot, oh my god, there's nooses. This dude added, <laughs> this dude added nooses. Oh, I just want to explore this and see what cool things we can find. I mean, the attention to detail to some people is freaking brilliant. Just just little storage space, spaces and things like that. Things I would never think of. You know, I would just add a wall here. No, they're going to add storage spaces. I mean, this complex door that has a locking mechanism. Uh, I wonder if I can open this. Hold on. Let me see if I can move that. All right. I'm trying to slide it out. Oh, there we go. There we go. It, it, I just I, somehow I moved it out. I, I used my, my thoughts to move it out. Now, this should hopefully open. I think maybe it opens this way. Yep. There we go. Opened up. Come on in, everybody. Come say hi. That's a really cool door, though. And then we got you know, like even torches down here. Oh man, I didn't. I didn't even know a lot of this stuff was added yet. Oh, we're a bit, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I okay. Bridges like to break under my weight. I guess it's saying I should probably lose some weight. Uh, I'm sorry about your bridge, Mr. Castle. I did not mean to do that. Uh, but maybe you should work on the structural integrity of it. Just the thought. What the fuck is this? Am I supposed to jump here? No, I'm not going to jump. But, uh, yeah, this is a walkway up. I guess we can walk down here, see if there's anything cool down here. Oh, my God. Okay. I, I thought this was just, like, a little outpost. But, no. It's going into the mountain. And, oh, my God. This is beautiful. Oh, wow. There's torture devices here. That's hot. I, that probably doesn't work. It's probably just for visual reference right now, but... Like, look at how much he fucking added! This is beautiful! I'm gonna have to get the name of this, uh... This mod, because this one is definitely... This one's gonna be in the description, guys, if you guys wanna download it. Absolutely fantastic. I mean, I'm lost in a dungeon right now. In, in a fucking dungeon. Like, th there's pulleys up here. This this will open. Will this open that? Well, is this a jail cell? Oh my god. Hold on. It does. It fucking opens the jail cell. Look at that. How how cool is this? You, you kind of got to crouch. It's a bit too small. But I don't care. I mean, that, that, that bed's made for a hobbit. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's a hobbit dungeon. There's even a fucking toilet. A toilet made out of a trebuchet part. Or not a trebuchet part, of a, a, a catapult part. That is brilliant. The uniqueness of this is amazing. I, I could just wander around here for a whole episode looking at things, and I might just do that. This is what an engineering game is all about. Not my simple-ass castles. Shit like this. I don't even know where I am. I'm, I'm on the side of the castle so far. I came in from a freaking mountain dungeon. That is amazing. Don't even know where I am. I, well, obviously I'm on I'm on the side of it. You can see if you're looking out there. There's a little house. Oh, that's the uh, that's the railway up. Okay, the, it's very easy to get lost in here. There we go. I am in the courtyard. Haha. -ha. 
All right, let's go into the main castle, see if there's anything crazy in here. We, we have another another statue, so that, that is obviously our king. That's always nice. Uh, I guess that would be kind of like a coat of arms that you could make so far. A very simple one. Okay, so this is outside. Uh, let's go back here, because this should be the king's cavern. Uh, oh, we get, we get, okay, it looks, looks like some sort of bar. That's cool. Um, I, I, I don't know. I just really like looking at what other people design, not me. Storage space. I mean, the thoughts of this, this is a bar with storage space. I mean, you got, you got storage space up there with ales, I'm sure. I just, I just love looking at people's designs. It's so fun. And, oh, we just went up one floor and there's more up here. There's, uh, the king's table, I'm assuming. <laughs> it's just, there's multiple floors. How cool is this? And, oh, look at this. The king's throne, I have found it. Ha <laughs> ha. Bow down to me, nobody in this game so far. I mean, it would be so fun. I, I, I'm not much of a, a role player, but if you could make a castle like this and have, like, 50 of your buddies just bowing down to you, God, that would feel like you were a badass. Oh, there's treasure. There's treasure. Oh. Oh, you change your player color. There's a player editor, and I didn't even know that. I'm finding new things. I can make a female? Oh, barbarians. The, the barbarians. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Getting way too excited about changing. Okay, I'm a barbarian now, I guess. Sweet. Okay, guys, I I, I better leave this place. I might explore this a bit more off off uh, recording, but it is absolutely like there's. Just, oh shit. Okay, there's just so much. There's so much too. Oh shit, I'm too big now. I think I think the barbarian is slightly bigger. That or yeah, I can't get through here. Oh yes, I can. Okay. Hold on, I just want to go down here now because I I said I was gonna be done, but uh, then I started walking down here. Oh, here's the um. The cart. Okay, so that this is where we started off. So I feel like this is a good place to end. I obviously didn't look at everything. There's just so much to this thing. It is freaking amazing. Oh wow. Okay, so this one's called Stone Fortress. I don't think there's much to this one, but it's kind of just showcasing different map designs. If you want some otherworldly like design, you can definitely do it uh, with the world editor. And you can see that, I mean, a very simple idea, he basically just changed the uh, size of the ground into the, these stone-like trees. Uh, really cool design. I don't think there's anything else here, but I thought I would just showcase this, because it does look very pretty. Uh, yeah, you can see it's just, <laughs> it's just a bunch of stone everywhere. That's really cool, though. I like the look of it. It looks very, uh, I guess you would say sci-fi-ish. If I wanted to make, you know... Some sort of weird town in an otherworldly land. This is probably the map I would use. I really love the added moss. It looks very pretty when you're down here. Oh, look at this. The game doesn't end at just medieval. We have pirate ships as well. Um, oh, this looks actually pretty cool. It, uh, obviously, there's not much to use to create pirate ships right now. So it looks like you use mostly just square blocks. And it's actually a little too small for my big-ass guy. I think I'm still using the uh, Barbarian. Uh, so yeah, simple design on the inside so far, unfortunately. But uh, the outside looks really good. I like... I like... I'm going to have to assume adding all those lines would have took a long time. But it does look really good. It almost looks like a model ship, though. It's a bit too small. Kind of cute, though. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> it looks so confusing. This is an automatic catapult. I am blown away. I cannot wait to see this thing work because it looks amazing. So I believe if I just press T on this, there's an invisible button that should hopefully work. There we go. There it is. And now I just watch. I, I don't even know how this... Th I can't fathom how this... Wow. Wow. No fucking way. Is it shooting? Did, did, did I break it? Oh. And it does it again. You can just keep loading cannibals up that thing. And keep firing them. That is brilliant. It works perfectly. I mean, look at that. Oh, shit. There we go. It's knocking it down now. Let, let's knock this damn clock tower down, why don't we? Man, it's already falling down. That was, that was a good shot. Holy shit. It's knocking the whole front down. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> that was a beautiful shot. All right, dude, do another one. Dude, there you go. Just keep them coming. 
Keep knocking them down. Holy shit, though. That, this... Bar none. This is the thing that has amazed me most. So, uh, so much in the workshop so far. This is amazing. I can't even... I don't even... I don't even know how you design things like this. This is... Well, I, I can understand how, actually, if you're looking at it. It's actually a really brilliant design. Um, with some sort of locking mechanism over here on this side of the wheel, and then a pu this side of the wheel just pulls the thing back, and then the when you pull the thing back, that unlocks this, which makes the ball drop. It's just amazing, though. Like, if us gamers were in medieval times, shit like this would have been invented, and the world would have changed for the better. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, man. I, I don't think I can kill the whole thing, though. I think it's pretty much... Well, I mean, it took out a lot of it, let's face it, uh, but I don't think it can reach the back here. It's not its not a very far-shooting one, that's thats my only complaint. It could work a little bit better in terms of distance, but I, I mean, that's not bad distance either. I'm not complaining or anything. That's amazing. And the final one is being loaded up. And then you could just, I mean, if you were just sitting back here, if you were actually in like a siege with multi multiple people, you could just sit here and load these things, like side by side, and then it could keep shooting. That is amazing. That is the automated catapult. That will be in the description below as well if you want to... Oh, wait, there is one more. How, how did I not see that? Interesting. Uh, anyways, yeah, that's the medieval catapult, automatic catapult. Amazing design. I am so happy about the future of this game, and that actually destroyed it very well. Anyways, guys, we're going to end this one here. That was just a few more of the player-made creations in the wonderful Steam Workshop. I'll keep doing that. I know i got to get back to building my own things as well. When I get time, I'll be doing that as well. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I love doing these videos, so thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. And don't forget, now that I remember, the giveaway is down below if you want to win a copy. Alright, bye.